Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum students. How are you? I hope you will be fine. My name is uh, Faiza. I am teacher of Peshawar Model School, Nushaira Campus of SST. In, uh, before my, uh, starting my lecture, first subscribe my channel. Now students, uh, take out your books and show me uh, the first page of your book just like this. Yes, this one is your book. Now take out your page 2. Now take out page 2. Yes, this one. Okay, uh, today uh, this is unit number one, geography. And today my topic is the earth in space. Now today my topic is the earth in space. Now, uh, earth. Earth is a planet. What is the earth? The earth is a planet and space. Now, the second word, space. What is space? Space, the difference between sky, the distance between sky and earth. This is called space this distance is called space the earth the sun and moon are all parts of the solar system what this is the sun the moon and the earth these all are parts of the solar system now i will explain the next word solar system underline it what is the solar system then i will explain this word solar system the solar system is made up of the sun and air planets what is sun and what yes underline it the eight planets solar system is made up of the sun and uh, the eight planets now i will show you a diagram of the solar system this one the sun and these are the eight planets first one is mercury venus earth mars jupiter saturn Uranus and Neptune. These all are the eight planets and this is the sun. The combination of the sun and eight planets is called solar system. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. These are the eight planets and the sun. The combination of the sun and eight planets are called solar system. Now, these uh, sun and eight planets move around it in space. Where is it moved around? It is moved around in space. The earth is a planet. It is surrounded by the atmosphere. Where is it surrounded? It is surrounded by the atmosphere. Underline it. This word atmosphere. Which is made of, which is made of layers of air that keep all living things alive. Now, the second word, the second term space. I have told you, uh, space is a vast darkness beyond the earth and sky. As I have told you, the space, the uh, distance between the earth and uh, the earth and sky, this distance is called space. There is no there uh, there is no light or air in space. But there are millions of stars and planets, millions of kilometers away from the earth. These are away from the earth because these uh, millions of stars and planets, these are actually the, the place of these planets and stars are in space. We see the stars at night, obviously. At the night, we see the stars, but we see the sun during the day. Never look directly at the sun. It can damage your eyes. We can't uh, directly look at the sun because it uh, damage your eyes. The sun is very bright star. Sun is very bright star. It has, it is a huge ball. This is the sun and it is a huge ball of very hot gases and it gives us heat and light at the daytime it gives us heat and also light it is much bigger than the earth earth it is much bigger you see this is much bigger than the earth sun is much bigger than the earth and other planets the earth is not fixed in one place it spins in an anti-clockwise direction it completes one round in 24 hours the earth also moves around the sun it takes a year for the earth to move around the sun it completes 24 hours 
one one rotation 24 hours and it takes one year one year for the earth to move around the sun no the second one is the moon what is the moon the moon is closer to the earth just like this this is closer to the earth than the earth and it is solid body it has no heat or light for its own it its light is a reflection of the sun's light at the day time the sun uh, the moon reflects from the sun the moon is called a natural satellite what is this is the natural satellite underline it natural satellite what moon moon is called natural satellite because it goes round the earth the earth and moon both move around the round the sun